Hey YouTube, it's Mike Pan Gangster here, and today I'm going to show you guys the best possible way I've learned how to kill Victor Rookwood. Now, in the background, you guys are watching me show you uh, my gear. Uh, just this is level 30 gear, actually it's level 29 most of it, but I'm level 30, and this is the best possible gear that I had at the moment, and I tried to basically spec in the, the Finto as my maximum damage spell. Now, I'm also going to use Maxima Potion uh, to basically break Victor uh, Rookwood's shield. Now. Uh, if you have a talent ability in it, when you use that potion, any possible uh, spell that you cast will break your opponent's shield. Now, the first wave, the best way to do it is basically just keep on like rolling around as much as you can and use every single throwable object around until you basically finish the wave. Of course, eventually you are going to run out of the throwable objects. So when that happens, of course, you're going to have to finish the mobs with your uh, regular... Uh, spells right the one that you're basically uh, The ones I'm using right here, but other than that make sure you try to use like I said all the throwable objects uh, Until like you have none no more and keep on rolling over and over of course You're gonna get hit by spells here and there unfortunately this game here Kind of like enemy switches you constantly which makes it very very annoying But it is what it is the other thing pay attention to these guys because they actually drop healing potions which again if you have a lot, you may not need them, but if you're someone that doesn't have too many when you're during this fight, I would recommend looking around, uh, paying attention basically when they drop, because of course that extra healing potion is always nice. As you can see, uh, we got to the part where I have no more of these throwing items, so I'm using basically my spells to finish off the last few mobs left. Of course, once this wave ends, you're going to encounter the second wave, which Victor Rookwood is going to be there. Of course, before this happens, uh, we have to finish uh, a few mobs left. And there's going to be a little cinematic of Victor Rookwood, which you're going to have to click one of your buttons. Uh, in my particular case, I have to click the uh, circle. As you see, when this happens, uh, very easy to basically win this little duel over here. Anyways, as you see, I do... Um, put my maxima potion on and right away when I cast on Victor his shield breaks unfortunate because of the targeting in this game is extremely bad I lose my target very very quickly because the game just kept like switching me which is very, like I said very very annoying but as you can see when I use my potion if I cast on him I could break his shield instantly and also uh, I do a lot of damage with my uh, basically my uh, little spec that I have going on with my four spe my four favorite spells of the game now, people ask me, what is the easiest way to kill Victor? For me, the easiest way to kill this guy, believe, believe it or not, it's actually to avoid trying to kill all the other mobs. The best way to do it is basically keep on trying to uh, target him when you can. Cast a spell that could break a shield. The ones I've noticed, for example, that break a shield very, very easily, it's the one that has the curse. The curse spells, the two green ones, uh, I like using the one that has the... Uh, it looks like a hand, the one that basically puts a dot on your enemy. It like it looks like you like whip the enemy or something. You're gonna notice it right here. I'm gonna do it right here. This one right here. Uh, it breaks his shield instantly. It also puts a dot on him, so it makes it easier for me to cast my spells on him. Uh, the other thing is, I said, like I said, try to avoid trying to kill all the other enemies and basically just keep on rolling around until you have the opportunity to basically break Victor's shield and then cast your little combo of damage spells on him. Again, uh, I'm not a perfect player, so uh, you see me taking damage here and there as much as you uh, like a lot of times. But at the end of the day, this is the way I found it was easy for me to kill him. I'm also playing this game on normal. I'm not playing on hard, but I imagine on hard, this is going to be one hell of a challenge, especially if you're under level. But there you go. Hopefully you enjoyed. Bye-bye.